Hey guys, so I just realized that I didn't create an intro for this vlog because I'm editing right now I'm like, okay, so where's the intro? When did I start this vlog? I just literally just started going through boxes of stuff I'm gonna do the intro now. Hi guys. How are you doing? I hope you're doing amazing But yeah, you guys I'm so overwhelmed right now. I feel like the last couple of days. I haven't been able to talk I don't know what I'm saying. I oh my god. I honestly don't know what I'm saying right now I don't know if I've had too much coffee or there's just so much going on because I just took in that I literally do 20,000 things in one day and I just I feel like I'm gonna crash one day and it's not gonna be good But I need to start writing stuff down and making a schedule because if you guys don't know on the weekends I make cakes, right? So uh, the cake process starts on Thursday because I need to start baking on Thursday and then decorate on Friday for Saturday's order and then Start Friday for Sunday's order kind of situation. Okay, so that starts on Thursday, right? And then it takes me one day to recover fully because I'm so tired and exhausted And then on top of that, I'm doing emails every single day non-stop trying to keep up to date with everything I'm I'm also trying to film content for Instagram and do pictures and like stuff like that that I already do And then on top of that I'm trying to edit YouTube videos and then promote those and on top of that I'm trying to stay in touch with you guys and respond to your comments and your DMs and on top of that I'm trying to eat healthy and work out and on top of that I'm trying to keep a healthy relationship with like everyone my friends my parents my husband everyone like try to make time for everyone and I just like these are a lot of things I know it may seem like it's not a lot but if you're a one-man team it's a lot because you're doing all of these things at once and they're constantly on your mind So you're like, okay, I'm doing this time I'm gonna do this next and then I'm gonna do this and I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna do that da, 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 da. You guys know what I mean? So I don't know if that just made you guys overwhelmed, but that is what I'm feeling But without further ado, let's start this vlog. Here is me unboxing all of my Sephora products and Amazon products Hey guys, so I thought I'd do a quick unboxing. I don't know if it's gonna be quick, but I'll try. A quick unboxing of all the Sephora stuff that I've got and a bunch of other things that I recently purchased or that were sent to me. I did ask you guys on Instagram if you want to see an unboxing of my Sephora products and like literally 93% of you guys said yes because the other option was no, I'm lame. So I'm just gonna do it here so I can like, you know, have everything in one place kind of thing instead of like flipping through stories and it will be here permanently. Okay, first the Sephora VIP sale stuff. I got the Pharmacy Green Clean Makeup Melt Away Cleansing Balm. This is my third bottle or container, whatever you want to call it. Literally, it does exactly what it says. It melts away all your makeup. I had to read that. I don't know why. It literally melts away all your makeup and it smells so nice and your skin feels so good. Obviously, I would use this and then I would use a cleanser, especially with Indian makeup. And you have so much on your face and your eyeliner and your mascara and all that stuff literally just takes everything off yeah so highly recommend this oh my god so these two products i'm so excited about i've had eczema pretty much my whole life and it's been coming and going in waves uh when i was younger it was really bad but now it's getting bad again there was like a little bit of pause in the middle and i use like a steroid cream to help it and stuff so i ordered a skin fix brand their eczema line and it's the hand repair cream because i have really bad eczema on my hands and dermatitis face balm so this is for i think uh well, it's for your face but i don't have much on my face except for like maybe like my upper lip area or whatever so i'm really excited to try this because this is a clean product and if i can use this instead of using a steroid cream it'd be so much better thank you skin fix for literally coming out with an eczema line bless so I'm gonna try this out and I will update you guys on how it's working for me. I have to stock up on the Olaplex number six bond smoother. You basically put this on before applying heat to your hair and it makes your hair super soft and it's really good for your ends. So I ran out of moisturizer and cleanser because I wasn't expecting to be here for this long. So I only bought stuff in the smaller containers. So I ordered um, the fresh soy face cleanser. I have used this before and I did like it. And it also gets off all your makeup as well. I don't know if you guys know, but when you wash your face once, when you have makeup on, it still doesn't all come off. So after you use the melting, this thingy, the green clean makeup melt away by pharmacy, and then use this, all your makeup will literally come off and the last bit will come off with your toner. So. And then I wanted to try the Fresh Lotus Youth Preserve Moisturizer. So, you know, same brand. Just got the moisturizer. I use the Estee Lauder Hydrationist Moisturizer, but it's out of stock or whatever. Like, I can't buy it anywhere, so I'm like, I'll try this. And then I got, okay, this is like, I don't know if this is a good purchase or bad purchase, but I got the Glow Recipe Avocado Melt Retinol Eye Sleeping Mask for brightening and firming. I feel like I needed eye, like an eye cream, eye mask, because I don't use one. I bought this because the container 
is so cute like the packaging i need to open this now to show you guys literally everything from glow recipe has really cute packaging honestly packaging is like okay i thought this would be bigger but since it is eye cream i guess you don't need much oh my god i thought this would be bigger look how small it is it looks like this it really it's really cute it has like texturized container it doesn't really have a scent so that's always a good thing especially when it comes to your eyes i was expecting a bigger bottle but oh my god it comes with a little spoon thingy so excited so i'm running out of eyelash glue so i ordered the huda beauty sticky tack lash glue i usually use the duo black lash glue it's been doing me wonders for forever but i've heard so many good things about this so i am going to try this really excited to try this and then this one i was super excited about it's from milk makeup and it's the kush lip balm packaging is so it feels so nice it's like a metal kind of packaging and it has like i can't explain it but it's like magnetic and stuff and then it's like green because kush you know so it's green but it goes on clear and this is probably the best lip balm i've ever tried as soon as i got this this is the first thing i opened and tried on because i'm like i've been waiting for this so now that it's here it's super hydrating and it smells really good and it lasts literally for such a long time so really excited about this one i was running out of my contour stuff and i have so much already in england so i'm like i don't want to waste money either so i got the kat von d shade and light contour palette but i didn't get the big one i got the small one because it has two in one and it's you know less product because i don't need that much right now can we just say how dope this packaging is like this is vibe this is literally my vibe so there it has like the contour shades for my skin tone it is in levitation and subconscious subconscious is the contour one that is what i'll be using more than the top one but yeah then running out of brow pencil i'm literally running out of everything so i ordered the benefit brow pencil the ultra fine one in 4.5 i will always use the benefit brow pencils they're good good stuff good stuff so then i got my birthday gift which was like the free gift that you get from sephora and it's the milk makeup little package thing it's a, the little tiny mini blush and then the mascara and then the milk hydro grip primer so the primer i love it's absolutely the best primer i've ever used and i'm excited to try the mascara and the blush so got that and then i got this is so extra it's not needed i got like I'm going to open it for you. It was on sale. It's the only reason I bought it. But it's a mini fan brush. And I thought this would be perfect for highlighting your nose. Because I'm always using a random brush for it. I like to have designated things. So it's so cute. It's literally a tiny little fan brush. So I got that. I'm so excited to use this. It's so cute. Okay, so that is everything I got from the Sephora VIP sale. And then before the sale happened, because I didn't know the sale was happening, I don't know where I live these days, but I ordered a quick small thing from Sephora. So I got the Anastasia Beverly Hills Norvina collection palette the one in orange it's like three of them i think and i absolutely love it the colors are so vibrant and there's so many different kinds of colors you can use them as liner and you can use them as shadow and i thought it was like the perfect palette to have especially with summer coming and being spring and then fall and then it's pretty nice then i got the laneige water sleeping mask i never used to have a separate skincare routine for morning and for night so now i have two separate routines which is something i feel like everyone should have so i use these two for my this one for my lips and this one for my face oh my god this smells so good and well this is empty because everything's in my room right now but this smells so good and it smells really relaxing like when you wake up after you have this on all night your skin wakes up so plump it wakes up so hydrated and full of water and you know really plump so i really like this and this i haven't really seen much difference from this when you put it on it feels amazing but when you wake up in the morning i don't really see a big difference yet but i will still keep using this obviously and see if i you know see a difference but then i got the fenty beauty stella lip paint i love the fenty beauty's lip paints i have like the brown one the dark brown one and the red one and then i wanted like a nude color so i got unbuttoned i love it so the stuff stays on for like forever literally i'm not even joking and morphe was having a sale like 50 percent off the brushes and i always always need eyeshadow brushes like different kinds because when i'm creating creative looks i can't keep using the same brush because the colors are you know different so and i'm not trying to clean my makeup every single day 
So I got a whole bunch of eyeshadow brushes. If you guys want me to do like a detailed video on the makeup brushes that I have and use for what purpose, let me know down below and I can do that for you. Okay, on Amazon, I got some beauty stuff from Amazon. So because of TikTok, everyone keeps talking about the e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. So I got some off Amazon. I haven't tried it yet. I'm waiting to try this. I, I wanted to film this video first before I try this. So I'm really excited to try it. I have like pores here in this area of my face. So I'm excited. So for your toner, a lot of people use, or you're supposed to use like a cotton pad kind of situation. So I'm like, you want to just use reusable ones because there's reusable ones now. Like they're made from microfiber cloth and that's probably better for your skin anyways. So I got a whole bunch from Amazon. There's probably like 20 in here and it comes with a pouch like this. So every time you use it, there's literally enough for a week to use twice a day. And I every time you use it, you just throw it in here and then throw this whole thing in your wash and then they come out clean. I did notice that if there's way too much makeup on it, like if you're using this to remove your makeup, that stain won't come out. But if you're using this after you've cleaned your face and used toner, then this works perfectly fine. They will be totally clean. So I did try to use this to remove my makeup and there was so much makeup on there that the washing machine just couldn't get it out. So just use this for toner and it works great. It's reusable. Just wash it, throw it in with your clothes, whatever, and <laughs> save the environment. And then I obviously came here without a hairbrush. So I ordered the wet brush from Amazon. The wet brush is really good for detangling your hair. I usually don't brush my hair often, believe it or not. So the one time a month that I do brush my hair, wet brush. Guys, my foot is asleep. I've already made a video about it on Instagram and I have posted about this before, but I recently got the Ashi Beauty straightener and guys, this straightener either i've been using the wrong straightener my whole life or this straightener when i use it it doesn't like dry out your ends so usually because i bleached my hair at the ends to get that gray color i had so it's still growing out so when i would use a flat iron like the ones that i had it's like the new me one that i have it's the green color when i would use it and straighten my hair and as soon as i straighten the bottom and it was on like medium heat the whole the ends would be like It'd be like a squiggly line. I don't know if anyone understands what I'm saying, but it'd be like fried, literally. But with this, just smooth, like no tomorrow. And on high too, on high, so smooth. And it doesn't tug your hair, which is really good too. So if you guys are looking for a new straightener, this does come with warranty as well when you purchase it. It's really affordable. And also I have a code for you guys that you can use to save money. I'll leave all the information for everything literally down below. So if you guys are interested, make sure you check it out. Use the code, save some money, straighten your hair, and look how pretty it looks. So a lot of you guys always comment on my pictures on Instagram where I'm wearing contacts, asking what contacts I'm wearing, where they're from, da da da, whatever. All of the contacts that I have are from lens.me and and these are probably the most comfortable lenses I've tried. I've had other companies send me lenses and stuff and I just wasn't a fan. It was too hard to get into my eye. I couldn't take them out. They're irritating. And these contacts are so comfortable and the packaging, guys, okay, every time you order from lens.me, they always give you or your cookies like hello and then they the, there's like the solution in here and then there's like an eye kit so you can put some solution in here this little one so this is like on the go and there's tweezers and like thing another wand thing that helps you put the contacts in your eyes for people that have long nails and it's hard and there's also little cases so and a mirror so I felt like that was really cool. And then inside it looks like this. And then these are all like the lenses. So these are new colors. I haven't really tried them yet. I'm excited. They're obviously gonna be amazing because I have no complaints for any of the colors that they sent me. So I'm really excited to try this. I have a discount code for you guys as well for this too that they gave me for you guys. So if you guys want to try out the lenses or if you guys want the ones that I have, I'll leave the ones that I do have down below so you guys know which ones that I use. And then I'll also leave a discount code for you guys to use as well, if you're interested. But yeah, that's all I have recently for now. And I guess this, as I get packages, I will show them to you guys. Do you guys enjoy unboxing videos or like me unboxing stuff and just showing you what I buy? If it is, then I'll just throw them in my vlogs whenever I do get something. But let me know down below and I'm going to go eat something. So I'll see you guys later. The lighting upstairs is so much better than the basement. But I spent so much time down there. So I'm honestly so sorry for the really bad lighting in the basement. But that's honestly where I spend a lot of my time and stuff. So that is... Is the best I can do with lighting down there. It's horrible and I'm very sorry, but it won't last for long. 
But yeah, so I just woke up. It's 9 o'clock in the morning on a Wednesday. And I'm going to edit this vlog for you guys and post it today, actually. So I'm about to go for my walk. Today starting as a good day. I weighed myself after so long. Finally down 7 pounds after like 8 weeks. Which I think is like the healthiest way or the time frame to lose weight or whatever. I don't know. But I feel good. Um, I feel super happy. I mean, I've been feeling happy every day. I've been taking it really easy on myself. And the best part is, like, last night, I had three double stuffed Oreo cookies and I still lost weight. And I was like, yes. But I know you can eat what you want to lose weight. It's just calorie deficit kind of situation or whatever. And working out and all that. But just got thrown in there because yo, I had Oreos and it still dropped. It just makes you feel, it just makes you more aware that you don't have to be healthy 100%. But obviously it will help you get to go faster. But if you want this habit to last longer, you have to have the things you love along the way. So I just thought I had that in there for anyone that might feel a little bit motivated by that. But basically every day I've been waking up and going for a walk, about four kilometer walk every morning. And then I come home, have breakfast, shower, and then do work. And then I would do my workout in the evening before I have dinner. So I'd work out, shower, and then I have my dinner. So that's kind of what my routine is right now. Uh, I've been doing it. I'm acting like I've been doing it for forever. But I've been doing it for the last week. And it's been good. It's just like sometimes when I wake up in the morning, I don't feel like working out. But going for a walk wakes you up. And also going for a walk just makes you feel better and in a better mood. The weather's not ha the weather hasn't been the greatest here. But the sun's out today. It, it was out on the weekend too. So I'm really excited to go for my walk today. And then, yeah. But I'm going to end this vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you guys next week. Remember to always stay gold. And I love you guys. You can put your dollar on me. Promise I'll be everything you want and you need. You got me going up and above. I can't get enough. It's like you put a spell on me. If you really about it, then I'm about it for sure. Yeah, you know I'm different than the ones before. Ain't nobody gotta know we can keep it on the low. You're the one I've been looking for.